Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new episode of WA Supercard, episode 173. Alright, so in today's episode, we've got some King of the Ring. Uh, let me just quickly show you that. Um, oh, we've just made it to the semis. That's pretty cool. Hopefully we can make it to the finals and get a, another WrestleMania card. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, that'd be back-to-back -back, uh, WrestleManias from King of the Rings, which would be great. Two days, four hours left in ring domination. We've got the ultimate Randy Orton, so that most of you probably already knew that, but I will use a spoiler alert for the WrestleMania. So if you guys don't want to know who it is, this is the time to get off the video. The WrestleMania is Brock Lesnar. Um, it's pro for me. It will just barely make my deck, I suppose. But yeah, I mean, no regular WrestleMania right now is really worth it for me at this point because. Well, I suppose it is, but like if you go, if I just go autofill, um, I've got yeah, I got Goldberg, Undertaker, Randy, yeah, like yeah. Well, I suppose Brock Lesnar, Triple H, and John Cena. It's pretty much it. Yeah, pretty much it. So of course they are still worth, but only some. So we will get that Brock Lesnar. Not sure when I'll get him pro. Uh, it might take me a while. And talking about pros, let's keep you guys up to date on this. Uh, I've got a couple more games left to play on Samoa Joe before we can get him pro And I've got, I don't know how come I haven't finished Triple H, but we've got a couple more games as well on that trips. And then we have got Sasha Banks as well. And she's almost there, almost. Hopefully by next episode I'll have Samoa Joe and both Triple H ready to pro. Uh, Battleground rewards as well. Let's go ahead and open those. Uh, we're looking obviously for females. Um, and then elite wise or ultimate wise, just yeah, like catalog really. Let's go and open this ultimate Rusev. Uh, nope, that's not catalog. Uh, elite Roman Reigns. Nope, we're gonna get about points, and we are now about to get our WrestleMania. Charlotte, Asuka, Alexa, Naomi, Nia Jax, uh, Roman Reigns, John Cena. Brian Kendrick, The Miz, just those kind of people. Uh, Alright, come on. Boom! Under oh, it's such a good card to get, but I already got a pro. Already got a pro taker. It's a, it's a cool card to get. Uh, I never thought I'd complain about getting an Undertaker. I'll just quit the app there. Um, that, yeah, that I can all train that away, kind of. There is also a pro, and I did get my pull, and again, I forgot to change it down there. I have gotten a pull since Paul Heyman, uh, and I'll show you, if I've still got him, who that was. Okay, so rewards are good. Uh, da, 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 da. I hope I still have him. I do hope I still have him. Let's go on. General cards. WrestleMania. I did silver star him. Um, oh, and I've got something. Yeah, there we go. It's Finn Balor. Um, he would probably have just made my deck. But by the time I would have gotten Triple H, Samoa Joe, Prod, you know, Brock Lesnar now. It's just not really worth it because once I get those cards done and I was closer to getting those cards done and then I would have been the Finn Balor. Don't really care. So I did Silver Star him. Uh, these are actually all the cards I need pros of. Oh yeah, I forgot I had like Neville, Sami Zayn as well. That's, uh, that's a good thing. And I did a pack opening, a Hall of Fame pack opening, guys, last episode, I think. Thank you so much, guys, for the support on that video. It's almost at 10,000 views and it's been a long, long while since... Uh, We've got a video that you guys have enjoyed that much, so uh, I'm glad you guys did. And uh, there's a little bit more news, so you guys know I did get Macho Man, Randy Savage in that pack opening. Got an ultimate as well, and, and lots of you guys commented about the American Dream Roberts and uh, the American Dream Diamond Dallas page. It was a bit weird, just probably a glitch. But then I opened another pack, and uh, I got Mick Foley, uh, and I was really happy with that, because he's cool. And... Well, it's the only Mick Foley card in the game. Before any of you say, oh, but that's not true. Mick Foley we've never had. We've had Mankind. We've had we had Cactus Jack. I don't even know. But a Mick Foley card, as you can clearly see, he doesn't have any pictures. He might have had in Season 1, I don't know. But definitely not in Season 2 or Season 3. So I'm really happy with that. Hopefully I can eventually get a pro one of these guys. That'd be sick. Um... Macho Man is still my champion because I think the picture looks great. But anyway, enough talking. Let's get in some ring domination. Ah, oh, God, it's gonna be it's gonna be again such a grind for this Seth Rollins. Um, I, I started work today at nine, got off at seven thirty, and then I'm working again at nine tomorrow. 
So yeah, it's just I need I need to grind when I get back pretty much. I finally understand how hard it is for everyone else <laughs> for getting the cards. So uh, I am sharing your guys' pain. A couple of people have already messaged me about getting um getting that uh Seth Rollins. Sick card, it looks amazing, can't wait to get it. Can't wait to get pro of it to be honest. Uh hoping it's the last card in WrestleMania tier. What else did I want to talk to you guys about? Yeah, because the last episode was actually talking about the update, and there's a couple of things I've noticed since. Um, mainly, the money in the bank. You can now get five contracts for money in the bank, so you can get 50 now for a win instead of 40. 40 was the max. 50 is now. So if, just, if you're wondering, guys, to get 1,000 contracts, you need to play 20 games of money in the bank. So, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's, yeah, I mean, it's going to help. Quite a lot. Um, if you think of it, you have to play 25 games to get a thousand. That's 20. It definitely helps. Um, so I'm I'm happy with that. I would, it definitely in the future they should uh, they should keep adding to it because, well, the more tiers we get, the higher amount of contracts we need. Unless unless there's a reset. But yeah. Anyway, and also got the new cards to show you guys in Money in the Bank because the cycle has ended and that confirms that I did not get anywhere near getting that Alexa Bliss. And if we go back about 20 videos ago, or I don't know, 15 videos ago, I, um, I'm pretty sure I was like, I am definitely going to get that Alexa Bliss 100%. But we didn't. We failed completely. So I hope you guys aren't too angry about that, but Money in the Bank is just such a grind. And maybe, just maybe, if I wouldn't have, if I wouldn't have got, I had any work, I could have maybe grinded Money in the Bank. But with work now, on top of having to play events and having a life you know outside of work as well social life is you know it's it's extremely hard so there's just no work could have done money in the bank but if everything goes well i'm just gonna whenever whenever i do whenever i can whenever i'm like oh, okay nothing to do let me just play a couple money in the bank bouts and hopefully eventually i'll get to a decent amount of contracts where i can redeem a pro in the next tier after wrestlemania because that would be very useful if you cash in straight away but then you can have the argument of waiting to the female. But I'm, I'm going to genuinely cash in if it's a wrestler I like straight away. Um, let's see if we can get a shard. We'll play another game. And then I think we'll end the video there. Don't want it to be too long. Because I'm off to bed, to be honest, after this. Fucking knackered I am. Um, so it's going to do me good. Like, super card. Not even going to bother with it tonight. I'll just, yeah, I'll see if I can do it tomorrow. Uh, let's go with, oh, I didn't mean to do that. But yeah, that's fine. I meant to go with John Cena in the middle. I should have done that right at the beginning. That was a mistake. Because John Cena will probably be the WrestleMania card, either for RTG, for the team event. He's gonna he's gonna be given soon, because he's now the only card who hasn't been in an event. Um, Brock and John were the only two, and now Brock is in this ring dom. So that's pretty cool. I'm um, pretty sure, yeah, we've definitely lost this game, which sucks. Oh, no, we haven't. Not definitely. Uh, power, please. Please call power. Toughness, speed, proc. I think we won that. Oh, no. Oh, I wanted Matt to win. I, I, never mind. God, that that's 7-2. That is embarrassing. Toughness, proc, taker. Never mind. Awful. Absolutely awful. All right, guys. Let's get our shards. Hopefully, we can... Let's get our picks. Hopefully, we can get a shard. That'd make up for it. Um... Well, that's pretty much it, really. Uh, yeah, the new Money in the Bank cards. That's what I wanted to show you guys. We'll do that straight after this. The picks, by the way, are increased because of that glitch uh, in Ringdom where the first proc in the game, like, it will give it to your opponent's card. Um, yeah, I don't think I explained that very well. But, yeah, read what um, Supercard on the lot on the bulletin board thing on the on the app and that that should explain it for you guys but i'm guessing you've all experienced it i definitely did i was about to tweet about it as well and then uh, and then it came up and popped up on my screen my supercard were like oh yeah yeah we know there's a problem so yeah um all right what's this what's this what's this chat going on our team chat it's not very important uh, money in the bank let's do this so there we go it is obviously the money in the bank winners baron corbin and carmella Interesting, because Carmella isn't the Money in the Bank winner. She probably will win on SmackDown this Tuesday. But, uh, yeah, pretty cool. The card designs are nice. Um, I just think because... I think they're just... All the Money in the Bank cards are quite the same now. Just with a different kind of pay-per-view background. You know, they're all kind of, kind of the same, if you think about it. 
and especially because they've they've probably did that, done this one quite recently because of the money in the bank. Like they've got the white briefcase in the back that was only revealed a couple of weeks ago or like a week ago, um, and you know. So you know maybe they didn't have so much time to do it, but it's not the best. It could be, but it could be better definitely. But yeah, those are the rewards. We're on like uh, twenty three thousand three hundred. I did use a bit to get summer charges in battleground because I wouldn't have made it if not. Um, still three more days, twenty two hours on the WrestleMania Fusion. Of course, I will show you guys that in a video. We are hoping for AJ Styles, pretty much AJ Styles or Bobby Roode. Or Chris Jericho, or a well, yeah, Chris Jer any any one of these, Bobby Braun, AJ Styles, Chris Jericho, three right arrows, one left, Nia's right, Alistair's down obviously, and Carmella. Okay, they're not the best rewards like Alistair Black and both Carmella. I wish Supercard would give other wrestlers who aren't in other things in the same tier, like Carmella's now got money in the bank card, um, and she's gonna have this fusion. It's just. Yeah, there are so many other wrestlers it could have been, like Charlotte, for example, someone like that. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you guys have enjoyed it, do drop it a like, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for a brand new video. Till then, take care, and most importantly, peace out.